Nathan! I gotta go to school. Cemetery? Just leave me alone, Hayden. What was that? No, no, really, say it again. I said you oh! Hey, get off him! Oh crap, it's Will. Oh. Come on, man, let's go. I don't see why you can't just pick me up at my house. Why do I have to walk to yours? You're the one with the car. Are you kidding? It builds character. You get tougher every time those guys beat you up. Well, I get enough arguing and yelling and so on at my own place. I don't really want to see your dad. No offense. Yeah, well, I don't really want to see him either. Man, you must bruise pretty quickly. You already have a black eye. That's not from them. Oh, what happened? Are you alright? Don't worry about it. Just talk to me, man. I said don't worry about it. Fine. But one of these days you're gonna have to stand up to the people that hurt you. So, last day of school, man. You excited? I'm excited to get out of here for the summer. Why would you be excited? This place is your kingdom. Everyone worships you. Yeah, yeah. I'm serious. You're Will Edwards. Everybody does whatever you say. You led the basketball team to another successful state championship. Football, Nathan. All of your teachers loved you this year again. You're the cliche popular kid at this place. I just wish that I could have that kind of power. You know that I don't care about any of that, Nathan. Those people aren't my real friends. They just like to be around me. You're always better with people than I was. You know, you just have to be a little more friendly, man. You, you can be hard to talk to sometimes. There's just not many people that I want to talk to. Alright, let's get this over with. Okay, see you guys tonight. Oh, just to end of the school year party. Oh, of course. Hey, this morning you said you wanted to do the stuff that I did, I so... I said I wanted your power. The way that Hayden and them dreaded your appearance. That's what I want. Well, maybe you should start hitting the gym, man. <laughs> what was that? I have no idea. Well, go back. No, I think someone was shooting at us. What are you, stupid? That wasn't a bullet. Did you hear a gunshot? Let's go see it. It's like it shocked me. And I felt the surge go through my whole entire body. so much the object as it is you. So point your fist out like this. Now what? Act like you're punching it. <laughs> oh! oh god, you're terrible. Let me show you. You <laughs> so. You can't be so tense, man. I think it picks up on things like that. If you want to control it, you have to control yourself. All right, sensei. Oh 
man, that's so cool. Let me try. <laughs> hey, so you read all those comics and everything, right? Yeah, why? So this must be some kind of superpower, right? Well, from what I can tell, I think it's some kind of sound manipulation. What are you asking? So what can we do with this? Here it comes. Should I turn it down or make it a little more loud? Make it louder, see if it notices the difference. Oh! <laughs> oh my god. You didn't have to break his eardrums, Will. <laughs> oh, here, watch, watch, watch. <laughs> How does that even work? Doesn't the button need to be pressed? You know, so the electricity can activate it? No, I just use sound waves to vibrate it. Okay, so when you press the horn, a coil pulls back on a metal diaphragm, and then it releases the diaphragm, which creates a sound wave. Now, it does that m hundreds of times a second, and I did that basically just by vibrating the whole system. How do you know all that? My dad and I used to work on cars before my um, mom died. Okay. Come on, let's go. Hey, do that thing with your voice again. Oh, what? You mean... This? Or this. <laughs> man, this thing is awesome. Today was incredible. Yeah, man, absolutely. Hey, what about your party? Uh, no, I don't care about that, man. I had much more fun with you today. Man, it's getting pretty late. I'm gonna go home, take good care of this, and don't use it without me. I won't. What the hell are you so happy about? Where you been? I was just out with Will. What? You've got a curfew. What were you doing? Hey, open up! What's going on in there? This is my house and you're gonna follow my rules. Away from me, Dad! Nathan, is that you? What are you gonna do now that Will isn't here to save you? Will, come outside. Just do it. What's up? He, he started it, okay? I didn't mean to. He was gonna hurt me. Whoa, what are you talking about? Hayden, I heard him. I heard him bad, Will. What? What happened? He, he was gonna beat me up, but I got him off me. What did you do? Nathan. Did you use that thing? What were you thinking? He deserved it. How bad was it? He was bleeding a, a lot and coughing. This is not good. Did anyone see you? I don't think so. We have to call an ambulance. No! No, he'll tell them what he saw. Well then what should we do? No matter what, you're in huge trouble. Maybe me too. Maybe we can run away. What? Damn it, Nathan. 
I'll grab my stuff. Get in the car. Hurry up! Go! Where are we going? I know a place. There's an abandoned factory up north. It isn't too far from town, so we won't be far from any kind of resources. Take a look. Yeah, sure. Nathan, I'm sorry. I'm fine. No, no, I'm, I'm sorry. Fine. I'm fine. It, it's fine. It, 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 it didn't even hurt. That was my fault. Just let me work. realize you don't have any of your stuff. I thought about that, and it'll be until Monday before my dad goes back to work, so we'll have to go get it then. You sure? As long as he's there, I can't be. Alright, whatever you say, man. Home sweet home. I'd say it's an upgrade. Okay, what's going on, Nathan? Why didn't you just go home after what happened? You're the only person who knows about what we have. No, there's more. What happened? Nothing. Nate, I'm tired of you holding everything in like this. And I'm tired of you acting like some damn psychologist who wants to know how I feel all the time. I didn't ask for you to feel sorry for me, Will, and I don't want your sympathy. Nathan, put the object down. 
Okay, I think we need to set some rules for this thing. What are you talking about? It's too dangerous to be messing around with it all the time. First, I think it's obvious that we can't tell anyone about it. And then more importantly, we can't use it on people anymore. Who made you the boss of it? Because you're unstable, Nathan. You almost killed somebody because you weren't careful. Look, this isn't a toy. It's a very powerful force that we need to be cautious with. Look, you're my friend, and I care about you. You need to keep your emotions steady. Whatever. I'm gonna check the place out. No, it's yours, dude. It wasn't a question. Thanks, man. I know you said that we need to be careful with the object, but we can't just sit back and not push its abilities. What do you mean? Well, we have this immense power. I don't want to just sit back and waste it. Maybe you're right. Alright, this looks good. Cool, here, hold this. I want to show you something. Okay, I'm gonna yell, and I want you to try to imagine a barrier between us. You ready? Did it work? Yeah, man, that was awesome. That's just the beginning. Come on, bro. You got this. Come on, bro. You got it. Come on, keep going. Come on, bro. You got this. Go on. <laughs> Dude, nice job, bro. Don't do that one. All right, here we go. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. <coughs> <laughs> I hate you. Here, I have an idea. Oh my God! I can't believe you just did that! This calls for a celebration! What? Well, I need to eat some real food. I only pack so much. Well, let's go into town. Yeah. So we're going back tomorrow for your stuff, right? Good. So I'm getting pretty tired of that outfit. This is just crazy. What well, we did. I wish we could go back to when it all started. When we first got it. Before anything happened. Don't you? Yeah. All power and no consequences. Do you think the cops are looking for us? As missing kids? Probably. But as suspects? I don't know. I wonder if Hayden's in the hospital. So, a toothbrush, extra clothes, what else? Um, see if you can grab some food. Right. Is that Hayden? Oh. 
Please, please don't hurt me. We're not gonna hurt you. What do you want? Are they after me? What did you tell them? Nothing. I didn't tell them anything. You're lying. I'm not, I'm not. I, I told everyone it was a skating accident. What about all the noise? I said that I didn't know what it was. I had already called halfway home by the time anyone saw me. No one thought it was related. Please, just leave me alone. What was that? Hey! I didn't like where that was going. We should go back. We are. I may move back in. What? Now we know that they aren't looking for us. So what? So what? That's why we ran away. What about your parents, huh? You want to go back to that? We have a better life now. We can make our own way. Better life? Nathan, it's been a weekend. What are we going to do when we run out of money? Did you even think about that? Or is all you think about is that stupid object? My parents probably miss me like crazy. No, they don't. They probably didn't even stop arguing long enough to realize that you were gone. Well, at least my dad has somebody to yell at! I'm sorry, Nathan. You know, I could have stayed. I wasn't gonna get in trouble. But all I ever do is help you, and this is how you thank me. I'm going back. Brat, where were you? Are you crazy running away like that? Nathan, stop! What are you doing here, Will? What are you doing? Are you crazy? Where's he going? Nathan, stop! I want to be alone, Will. Drop it! Why don't you make me? I don't want to hurt you. You can't even touch me when I'm holding this thing. Nathan, you have to stop this. You're going to hurt more people. So what? All anyone's ever done is try to hurt me. And this is the first time I've ever been able to do what you told me to do. You told me to fight back against the people that hurt me. And that's all anybody has ever tried to do. So now I am. What are you talking about? I'm here. I'm trying to help you. No, Nathan, wait! You can't control it, Will. Nathan, please! What are you doing? Listen to me! <laughs> Nate, look at yourself! Okay, you can't do this! Don't worry about the people that hurt you! Just drop it! I'll protect you! I don't need your protection. You need my help! You're gonna get yourself killed! You'd like that, wouldn't you? What? I'm just a burden for you! A problem for everyone! No, Nathan! You're my best friend! You don't have to worry about me anymore, Will. Nathan, no!
No! No! Will! Will! Whew.